Hey everyone, welcome back to another episode here of Feed the Beast Unleashed on the uh, Stormcraft server here. And I was thinking that I want to play around with the drawbridges that uh, Tears Construct adds. So, um, that'd definitely be pretty fun. Uh, let's see here, let's go uh, drawbridges. I do have six of them already made, as you can see. I'm actually going to put those right here, and I want to make some more. So, um, I'm thinking I'd like to try and make six more of them. So basically what we want to do, whoops, if I can figure out what I'm doing here. Uh, let's go drawbridge, like that. And, uh, let's see here. Okay. So we're going to need ourselves aluminum brass, a blank cast, bronze, dispensers, and redstone to make the thing. Uh, so, let me see, uh, is there a difference between these two? No, there isn't. Okay. I don't see any difference in the recipes either. I wonder why I chose two of them. Huh. Anyway, let's see. Let's go aluminum, brass. I got 12. That's just enough for me to make the six that I need. So let's put that back in there. Um, do I have any in here? I do. Okay. Alright, so we're going to need, uh, one, two, three, four, five, and six. Like that. And let's get this thing out of the way. Okay. So, now we got that going. Uh, we're going to need the dispensers. So let's make ourselves six dispensers. Uh, bow here. One, two, three, four, five. Oops. One, two, three, four, five. Yep, that's all much I made. So let's go uh, sticks here. Oh, I don't have any sticks. That would explain things. Alright, what about uh, for wood here? What do I have? Uh, let's see. Let's turn this jungle wood into uh, sticks. And turn that into sticks, and turn this into sticks. There we go. Why not? Why not make lots and lots of them? Let's make some more ore add. I'm, I have plenty of spruce wood coming in now at that farm. So let's just fill this thing up full of sticks. Okay. Alright, so we got plenty of those now. Um, let's see here. So I got that. I'm going to need one more bow. Yep. Just want to make sure I did have six there real quick. Okay, so we got that. So now we can go and make ourselves six dispensers. So there we are. We got six dispensers now. So we'll throw that into the ME system. Um, how's this stuff mounted down? Done. Awesome. Okay, so let's make six of these plates. So there's one plate. Actually, you know what we could do so we don't have to do that ourselves. So let's put that right there. Look at that. Now we don't have to do it. Okay. So while that's doing that, uh, let me see here. Um... How much? How much ore do I have in here? Oh man, I have a whole bunch of it. I got all kinds of stuff in here. The redstone. I'm getting low on redstone. Let me see how much do I have. Oh, I guess I'm getting back up again finally. Um, with all the tinkers tools that I've been making lately, I've been using, you know, going through a lot of redstone. So yeah, there we go. All right, let's uh, put this in here. Oh, this pick by the way is pretty awesome. Okay, so it's got speed four, fortune four, uh, efficiency four, repair two, and ashes. It is so nice, and that Fortune 4 is pretty cool. So I use this for a lot of that stuff, and I have this one obviously for when I need to, you know, do the auto smelting for like regular wars. Um, this pick here though is pretty cool. Like the book I have right now down downstairs here, um, right here, it's only a tier four, so it wouldn't let allow me to get the pick I have. But uh, Ventna, one of the other people on the server, has um, a tier five book or a seven book or whatever it is, I think it's seven. Um, so I just used that one. Uh, let me see here. Let's go and put this thing back. And now we can go and make ourselves, let's see, put that stuff in there and boom. Oh, what? Oh no, I don't, I'm out of bronze. Okay, uh, that's not the right bronze recipe. Okay, so to make bronze, it's uh, tin and copper dust. Which I don't have any of. So let's grab some tin here. Let's grab some more tin. Let's go copper. Um, let's go one, two, three of that. And let's go down here. This thing is going to be much faster than using the pulverizer up above. Okay. Now let's run this through. Oh, I'm sitting here waiting for the Emmy system to pull that out, and I'm like, why, why isn't that working? And then it just occurred to me that, uh, does that even work? Oh, that does work? Oh, I don't have to actually grind this stuff up. 
Okay. Nice, nice. We'll just do it like this then. Look at that. Okay. Yeah, I was sitting there waiting for the ME system to go and pull it out of the thing, but I don't actually have my ME system hooked up to that yet. So that wasn't obviously going to work. Um, let's put that in there. Let's, uh, let's cook this stuff back up. Since, uh, you know, that's not how I'm going to want to do it. Um, whoop, went too far. Whoa, okay. I should turn the hover mode back on there. Moving much faster than I expect to be. Alright, so now we got ourselves all the bronze we could ever want. So let's do that. Put that in there. Alright, so we now have 12 drawbridges. Now, I, now we have to figure out what we want to do with them. Now, I have been thinking of a few things. Um, I haven't quite made up my mind completely on what I want to do with them. But, um, I figured, you know, we could try to figure it out on the way here. Uh, but what I was kind of thinking is we could have, like, maybe, like, like, maybe make, like, a platform that goes out or something, and, like, a door that does some cool stuff or whatever all at the same time, maybe. I'm not quite sure. Um, oh, but before we do that, uh, that brings me back to the Tinker's tools I said I was making. Um... Yeah, someone in the comments, thank you very much for telling me this, because I did not know about this. But, uh, yeah, if you use um, the Thomium ingots, it does the same thing as paper, but obviously is way better. So I remade a few, tool few tools here. Um, the lumber axe, uh, this hammer, and this hammer here are all made with the Thomium ingots. And uh, I put cobalt here for the hammer middle, and I put uh, cobalt here for the blade, because it didn't make any difference in the in anything. Um, I should have done that with cobalt for the, this part of this hammer here, but I just, I didn't know at the time, you know, that I should do that, because I made that hammer first. I was still experimenting. Um, so I'm probably going to actually remake that hammer. Um, I could remake that hammer right now, I suppose, but what's, uh, what's cool about it, though, is using the thomium ingots, it's, uh, it's nice because I can get a couple extra modifiers on top of it um, than I would normally get. So, like this hammer here is really fast. This is a really fast hammer that does the fortune, fortune and auto smelting. And then this thing here is a really fast uh, axe. And then I remade my pick here, uh, which is the same as the other pick I had, except for it uses the thomium stuff. So it's also much faster. This pick is actually about the same speed as this pick here, uh, which is pretty quick. This pick actually could be faster, as you can see it's only efficiency 4, I could have made it efficiency 5, but I didn't want to do that, because that was too quick for me, I did not like it being that fast, so I didn't I didn't keep it like that. Um, where is the other, it's in here, yeah it is, fortune 4, okay. Um, I need to make an anvil, let me see, how much, do I have any iron blocks, I don't, okay let's make some real quick. Uh, so we got some iron blocks now, and then we're gonna want. Oops. Okay. There we go. Let's make an anvil. Um, eh, right there is good. Wait. Okay, I can open that still. All right. Um, now can you combine these? Okay, you can. Um, but it's too expensive. Ah, uh, that's too bad. I was just seeing if maybe if you could combine like a couple Fortune Fours and get Fortune Five. Now. Um. Yeah, apparently not. Um. Because it's too expensive. All right, so that's melting down. Uh, but yeah, these uh, drawbridges. So it'd be kind of cool to do that. Um, I actually I try. I, I I really don't know what I want to do with those right now, though. Because like I said, I had a few ideas before I started recording, but I'm starting to think maybe I don't actually want to do that. Um, so for now, let's work on uh, making this um, this hammer uh, the way I want to make it. Um, so we're gonna let that melt down. Uh, we're gonna need uh, let's see, let's grab some iron here, and let's go head back to uh, the old base here, and we'll grab ourselves a little bit of this, because why not? Alright, okay, so we got that. Um, why are these empty? Someone else been using my stuff? Someone else has been using this, hasn't they? I swear I wouldn't have left it like that, I would have filled them up. Oh, that, was, that, that mob just, just despawned, but he was wearing the same armor I was, that's funny. Alright, so let's, uh, let's fill these back up real quick. Uh, since it looks like someone was here using this and decided not to refill them. It's kind of annoying. Oh, is that a wisp? 
No, I think it was just one little thing on that tree. Okay. Alright, so one of these ingots has eight, and then we're also going to need um, four magic per ingot here. So, uh, what we can do is that's actually the shards that I'm looking for are not in there. So let's go back here, um, and let's go shards here. Let's grab a couple stacks of those so I can keep some back here. Alright. So let's go and throw a stack of that in, and then we want that much should be more than enough for sure. Didn't feel like doing math, because, you know, why, why would I want to waste my time doing that? Ah, dang it, I must have gotten something wrong. I was hoping for a whole stack of thumbnail maggots, but whatever, we're good. We're good, that's all we need. Alright, so let's see here, let's, uh, did I ever fill that? Yeah, I did, okay. Let's put, whoa, come back. Let's put this stuff in here. Oh, in case you guys are wondering why this inventory slot here in my knapsack is so empty, um, I may have let a wither kill me, showing something to a friend. And, uh, yeah, I lost my knapsack with everything in it, including my power glove. And to try and get my stuff back, I ended up putting on my power suit, and I may have died again while wearing that power suit. So I may have also lost a full set of power suit armor full of upgrades. So that was pretty bad. Uh, so yeah, as you can see in here, uh, there's no power suit armor inside of here anymore, which there used to be. So yeah. Um, yeah, that was pretty bad. I thankfully, thankfully did not lose any of my armor that I'm wearing or any of the stuff that's in this inventory here because I had one of these on me. These things are amazing. I really hope that in a future update it's going to include the knapsack in it. That'd be pretty awesome because that was that was pretty, pretty crappy when I lost all that stuff, I'm just going to say. Uh, oh man, look at all that cobalt. Okay, let's go and put, uh, put those in there too. Um, okay, so what we want to do is I'm going to make myself, since we're making a new hammer, Let's go and make ourselves a cobalt hammerhead, because that's the only thing that I want from the cobalt right now. Just wait for that to fill up. Come on. Come on. Takes so much of it. Alright, so let's go put that back there. Um, let's go and put this in there. Grab the hammerhead. Okay, so then what we're going to want is we're going to want to grab ourselves a tough tool rod. Like so. And then we're going to want to grab ourselves a couple of the plates. Okay, so that should be good. Alright, so now, as you can see here, if we go to the hammer, and you put this in and this in, um, and these in like so, you can see it says five modifiers instead of three. Now, each, the thomium stuff will give you one extra modifier, and it looks like the max that you can get total is going to be five. But the nice thing is, is we've got the two extra modifiers, so that means I can put all kinds of redstone on this thing. Um, that other hammer I made, I didn't actually use the cobalt in this spot, uh, because uh, I ended up using the thomium stuff. But as you can see, if we use thomium here instead, you can see it's actually it does not change the modifiers, but it slows down the mining speed. So you can see we have a slightly lower mining speed, and also lowers the uh, max um, material that it can mine. So, oh, and the durability goes down quite a bit. So yeah, we want to use the uh, cobalt head instead, for sure. So that's what we're going to do. Uh, let's put that in there. Uh, we're going to want this hammer, and then we want uh, redstone. Let's see here. But yeah, this is how I've been losing all my redstone. Like, when I said I was getting low on redstone, it's, been, it's because I've been using it all up on my... Uh, on making new tools here constantly like this. So if we quickly do this, and we go in, uh, let's, whoops, wait, why did I take the hammer out? We'll go back in there. Alright, let's do this. Uh, hopefully it won't take me too long. I think I've got this, doing this down pretty quick because I've done so much now. Alright, do that, and then we'll do that, and then we'll do that. So many modifiers, so much redstone that can go on, it's awesome. Alright, so do that, 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 and that. Just keep on doing this, I guess, until we get uh, all the modifiers used up. Oops. Oops, nope. 
clicking too quick, I can't even aim properly. Alright, there we are, and grab that. And there we go, okay. So now what we want is to grab ourselves a gold block, a diamond, and we put this on here, we get an extra modifier, we keep doing it. Now remember this hammer is just nothing but speed. This is all that's all I want this hammer for is to be really fast. So nothing else goes on it. Um alright, let's do that. Alright, so then what we can do now is let's see, how many wither? Only have one, huh? Hmm. Let me see here. Let's put this in here. Uh because I don't have any nether stars sitting in here, I don't think. No, I do not. Okay, so what we're gonna do real quick here is we're gonna go and run down. Go down to where our wither skeletons. Oh, I, I guess I've never showed you guys this. Um, okay, so I spent uh, a few hours the other night uh, getting myself a uh, tier 5 wither skeletons shard, and I put it right here. Now, I know this is not like some automated system. I didn't want it to be automated. I just wanted a way to get these guys. So basically, what I do is I turn the switch on, and they just spawn right here like so. And then, um, that's, that guy just poisoned me. I think he did. Let's kill that thing. Um, yeah, and then I just let these guys come funneling towards me like this, and I just kill them. So, that way, you know, it's not all automated and stuff like that. So, I wanted it like that. And then I usually stand underneath of the, um, note block, or that, that dampening block there, so we don't have to listen to all the noise, because these guys can be really loud. Uh, do I have any heads yet? No, we do not. Okay. And I, I'm not gonna die either, especially because my armor is good, and because I'm underneath of my beacon here. So, that works out pretty well, for sure. Um, let me see, kill you. Wait, do I have any withers? Called? No, I don't, okay. Because I know I know I was keeping some inside my ender pouch there, but I didn't have any in it. Um, I, I haven't gotten a single head yet, really? Come on, guys. Come on, drop, your, drop some heads. I wonder if, uh, a see the sheath, sheath? I can't say it, but I wonder if those things work better. Oh yeah, I got two of them there. Okay, fine. Pig hat. What? That's funny. Guess I didn't have that yet. It's also a good way to get hats. <laughs> this right here. Like these guys. Yeah. See, like there's another new hat. I get all kinds of new hats from this thing. It's awesome. Um, come on. I just need. I just want one more. I could go get that one I had in my ME system up there, but nah. <laughs> Abraham Lincoln hat. Nice, nice. Uh, come on. One more head. That's all I want. Come on, guys. Come on. Really? Really, you're not gonna give me one? Oh, I'm, I'm starving to death. Look at that. Just give me a second, guys. Just hold up. Be right with you. Be right with you. Okay. Come on. All right. What do we got? Two. Okay. Just hoping that maybe by now I had dropped one. Uh, whoa. Guys, knocking me all over the place. All right, what if we get up here a little bit? Is there any up here that have dropped? Doesn't look like it. Jeez. See, this is why I like having this tier five with their skeleton skeleton spawner. Is because of the fact that it's so rare sometimes for, the, for these heads to drop. I mean, just look at how many of these things I am killing right now, and I still don't have three heads yet. That's that's crazy. I should probably go up to the Emmy system and grab that extra head I have, because this is taking way too long. Um, okay, let me uh, turn that thing off. That's the kill we've got here, and if I don't get a head from him, then I'll just go up and grab that. Alright, uh, let's see, any heads around here? Doesn't look like there's any heads down here. Um, Yep, okay, so let's go up to the enemy system and I'm just gonna grab one from up there. Whoop, there's still a guy running around where are you? I can hear you, but I don't see you. Where are you? Must be up uh up this way then around the corner. Yep, there you are. Give me a head. Nope. Okay, that's too bad. Alright, let's go grab one out of my enemy system here. And then we're gonna go and kill ourselves a wither. Alright, so let's go, uh, wither, and then let's put all of this stuff into the ME system, and I'm just going to throw all this stuff into the corner here. 
Okay, don't want any of those. Taking up all my room. Okay, so let's go back down. Because this is also where I killed the wither. So if we can... Oh, hey there, guy. Still another one running around. Alright. Let's grab... Uh, I guess we grab all this stuff here, too, while we're at it. It's a whole bunch of coal and bones. It's all good stuff. Uh, it's too bad these, there's so many useless swords all over the place. Okay, that's all of it. Can't hold anymore. But yeah, what I usually do is I come in here, and uh, I, put, I spawn the wither in here. Uh, we're going to go and put the swords into the corner real quick. So just give me a second to get rid of those. Uh, let's put this stuff in here. And grab ourselves for soul sand. Alright, let's get this with the spawner. So basically, what I do, assuming I can remember how you build this guy, uh, you just do this, get that started, and close that door. And you wait. And wait some more. Come on, guy. And then he does his thing, and we come in here and we kill it. It's so loud. Why are you so loud? Ah. Man, this, this guy is really loud. Okay. Wow, that was... Wow, that was loud. Okay, so there we go. We got ourselves our... The Witherhead. Or, not Witherhead. The, uh... Nether Star. Yeah, that's what you call that thing. It's a Nether Star. Okay. So we got that. Let's go, uh... Oops, wrong button. Let's go back up here. And... Let's make... Uh, let's put this on here. There we go. So we got an extra modifier slot now so we can go and finish doing this alright there we go it's got 27 uh, mining speed which is let's see compare it to the old one the old one had 25.66 this is 27 so yes it is faster not like crazy faster but it is faster which is what I wanted um, let's stand on this thing for a second here, recharge ourselves after that battle. Love this wireless charging system, it's pretty cool. I could put some upgrades and stuff in here, but uh, there's no real need to, I guess. Um, I would like to have the nicer one, but the thing is I haven't come across any Iridium yet. And I haven't made a Matterfab or anything like that, so I don't know if... I mean, I don't have any plans to make one at the moment. Probably should do that, but, uh, why, I, don't, I don't know. I don't really have a power system set up to do that yet. Uh, there we go. Okay. So let's go about 300,000 blocks out. Why not? <laughs> yeah, I'm working on trying to get up to a uh, million blocks away. Why? I don't know yet. But uh, I just feel like doing it. So that's what I've been doing. Uh, let's grab ourselves that. Uh, yeah, okay. So let's test out these hammers then. Alright, so basically, uh, this hammer here, I'll show you the old one first, is pretty fast. Like, like just like look how fast this thing is, right? So that's the old one. Uh, torch here, um, and here's the new one. Look at that! Look at that! It's, it's even faster. This thing is just this is crazy. Just look at that. The amount of stuff I can clear up. It's it's awesome. I love this. Man, this is a cool hammer. Like once again, thank you so much for you know telling me in the comments that. Uh, I could do this because, man, it's nice knowing that. Did not know that you could even use thomium stuff. All right, what else we got? Anything? Oh, okay, grab this. Might as well grab all the tin here. I haven't been getting a whole lot of tin lately. Um, grab the, grab this because I why not? I have lots of iron, so it's not like I'm in. You need for it, and then coal. Man, I do not need any more coal, but uh, it's coal, so let me rephrase that. I do need it. If it's coal, you need it. Most valuable thing in the game. That's what that, that's what coal is. Let me grab myself some more of that tin, grab a little bit of this iron. It's a pretty fast pick, too. And then the Fortune 4 in it. Awesome. I love me some Fortune 4. Uh, put that there. And grab this stuff. Oh yeah, and then I guess I guess I could show you that guys that here real quick, so then I can get myself to stop mining here because I get crazy when I start mining. Okay, so as you can see, this thing here is pretty quick, right? This is also like just as fast. 
If anything, it's actually, it could be, let me see. Boom, 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 boom. Yeah, I'd say they're actually probably both exactly the same speed. Um, so yeah, so it, it's pretty cool. The uh, reason why I usually use this one a lot lately over the thumb, the thumb, or the thumb, thumb one. The uh, Tinker's Construct one is just because of the fact this has uh, Fortune 4 in it. Um, but yeah, like I said, if I'm usually what I do, um, I don't always do it, but usually what I'm doing with this pick is if I come across like tin here, I usually will actually mine with this one because then that way I'm, you know, smelting and fortuning it at the same time. But if I grab it, you know, with this pick like I am now, it's not that big of a deal because it's just going to go in block form back to, you know, the ME system. And then I'll just throw it into my, uh, into the filler and it will just build up a huge, uh, thing full of it. So that way I can, you know, just take and throw it all up in there and I'll come by with my hammer and I'll do the smelting fortune thing uh, with the hammer instead a little bit later. So that's what I usually do. But here, let's go back. Um, and let's throw this stuff in here. Uh, get all of you in here. And let's put the hammer right there and then I'll uh, put that right there. Okay. Oops, wrong button. Alright. Let's uh, place this guy right there. And then let's get our jingles. There's no reason to do so because as you can see I'm almost at level 100 here. It's not like I need any more levels. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna grab them. Okay. So there we go. Uh, let's go and let's see. Let's go up to this floor. Now I don't really and I'm trying to think of what I want to use the, uh, what I want to use that, like those extender thingies, uh, what do you call them? Um, here, let me do an F3A so we can fix that chunk area down there. Um, I can't think of what they're called right now, the, ex the extending things that we just made in the beginning of the episode. It's, they're called, uh, um, oh no. Oh no, I, I need to know what they're called. Drawbridges, aha. We could, should use the drawbridges to make a drawbridge, obviously, but I don't know what I want to do. I could put them like, like what if, like what if I had a pressure plate here and the drawbridge is here, and you like hit the pressure plate, and like this moves out of the way, and then it like, extends a thing out like so, and you could extend out like I think it will go about this far, and then you'd have like a little like diving board dive down into the water or something, you know? You know, that actually sounds pretty interesting, not to think about it. Um, how would we make that work, though? Because we need to have those pull out of the way, but then we also have to have room for the drawbridge itself to be able to go out. So, we'd have to have somehow get that to work with each other. Um, and I don't want to have, you know, the fence be gone, but I could... Just get rid of the fence right here, because it's not like you're going to fall, because if you're walking up to the drawbridge right here, um, you're going to hit the pressure plate and the drawbridge is going to extend anyway. Uh, and the fence is going to go away. And if you're just like walking along the edge here, it's going to activate it and cause it to do that anyway. So it's not like you have to ever worry about falling. Hmm. For now, we could just do that. Oh no, that, that nice diamond axe is gone, isn't it? Oh, crap. Yeah, I forgot you can't shift click with this thing. Um, ay, ay, ay. Okay, that could have been really bad if. Uh, whoa, why am I? Why was I sliding like that? That could have been really bad, potentially, uh, if that thing had decided to look back at this and notice it was a tree and just go boom. I just saw that whole thing. That would have really been bad. Okay, so let's 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 see. Let's go down here. Oops, okay, let's go down here like so. Wanna grab ourselves some diamonds. Do that, and then we want some sticks. Make ourselves oops. Ourselves a new axe here. Let's go down and let's go back to the old base. And let's go and let's give ourselves, let's see here. Let's go efficiency five. I'm breaking. Uh, silk touch, why not? Ashes. 
Uh, made of arthropods. Obviously, don't want that sharpness. Oh man, look at that. That's crazy. I can put sharpness on this thing. Um, hold on. Let's bring that down a little bit, and then kind of put that back up to three. Okay. Let's enchant that. And now, can I finish putting that up to that? Yes, I can. Okay. All right. Look at that. Now, this is not. This is a deadly weapon here now too. That's cool. Okay. All right. So now that we're done using that very OP uh, enchanting system, let's go up here, and we're gonna want to get rid of. Whoa. Did not want to do that. Whoa, what is going on? Oh, I landed on that that time. Alright, where did that other block of wood go? I want that back. Um, did I actually grab it? No, I didn't. Okay, so it's up here somewhere. Probably on one of these trees, maybe? Where did that thing land? Um, maybe it fell into the smelter? Yep, okay. Alright, so let's go back up here. And then what we can do is grab ourselves uh, some of these drawbridges here. But yeah, so like if I point these drawbridges out, now you look at that and it's like, oh, that doesn't look that great because it doesn't match. Well, if you put a block right here, look at that. It causes them to look like a said block. So there we are. We have drawbridge, but you can't tell. So that's what we wanted. Um, now what I can do is I can put like a stack of the redwood bark into it. So let me see here. If we go down to the ME system. And let's go redwood. And we want the bark. Um, I want three full stacks of this stuff. And then, oh, let's grab ourselves some pressure plates already. Let's go um, wood pressure plates. I guess I don't have any of those made right now. So we're going to make some. Uh, I don't have any actual pure wood right now, do I? Let's, let's do, fix that. And then we'll do that, and we're going to want us to make a stack of, well, half a stack of them, whatever. That should work out. Let's get rid of those. Okay. Back up to the top, then. Oh, oh, come on. If I can, well, okay. Alright, so we go back up here. Uh, we can go and put stack. Oops, not quite how I want that. Put a stack here so it has a stack to use for the extending. And then we can go and put some pressure plates here. And then um, I probably should use the invisible pressure plates eventually, but right now these will work. But yeah, as you can see, it extends out. Oh, okay, that's weird. It's just a little bit of lag. Um, okay, so I'm going to want to hook this up probably so that way they all go out at the same time when you're standing on. Instead of, you know, just like that. But these draw bridges are really cool. How this works. <laughs> what I should do, it, what I think I'll do, it's I'll do this off camera though. But what I should do is get this set up so that when you step on the pressure plate, um, it'll actually like kick in a little bit of a timer and cause these things to actually extend all the way out and stay extended for a little bit and then come back in. So that way you can, you know, actually have time to walk to the end of said drawbridge extension. And then uh, I can also set it up so I also have like, you know, the maybe I could try setting up the fence thing too while I'm at it. But for now, I mean, you guys just got an idea of what, what this can do. So it's pretty cool for sure. Um, for now though, so I don't have to keep these on me, I'm just going to do that. Uh, let's put the drawbridges in there. Those back in Miami system. But yeah, the drawbridges are pretty cool as you can see. Look at that, look at that. There we go, now it's full extended. Um, so yeah, I mean, it looks like it extended to about this far. I, that's far enough to be able to jump into water, so that'll work. Uh, but yeah, I think that's going to um, end it for this episode here. I hope you guys found this episode interesting. If you did, please consider leaving a like and subscribing. And I hope you all have a wonderful day. So, bye-bye. Uh,